Good Friday morning, YouTube. BD King 721. It's been an interesting morning for me. As you can see in the background, I rode my bike into the office today. It's actually one of those electric assist bikes that maybe some of you have seen on the roads these days. They're kind of popular. Uh, they, at least they're popular around here. Um, bought one a couple months ago. I just haven't. I just haven't. Uh, taking it to the office. I've got about a six mile ride to the office, uh, all on surface streets. So it's relatively easy, but was able to get off my butt and do it this morning and looking forward to the ride back. But I wanted to catch up on some mail uh, and get off into the weekend. I think I'm going to be, I'm going to a card show tomorrow. So I'm going to try to go to a card show tomorrow. I've heard that it's very crowded. Uh, so I will let you know how I did with that. Um, let's see. So I brought in some cards this week. Actually, this one here. This is the 2019 Vlad Guerrero rookie card from Flagship with the no name or no number, I guess. NNO, I guess is the designation for it. Uh, I actually found this in the box of commons. I didn't realize I had it. I think at one point when I was opening this stuff, put it in there, forgot about it, and pleasantly surprised when I pulled it out. So kind of a cool card to find, a little bit of a, a gold nugget in a pile of rocks. So happy about that. This is actually for trade or sale. If anybody's interested in this card, I'm probably not going to do much with it. It's It could be gradable. I really haven't given it a real hard look. Uh, generally, the 2019s that I've opened have usually had at least one corner issue with just about every card that comes out of them. So, But if you're interested in that, let me know. Uh, I did pick up another 2016 Topps Chrome Blue card. I'm down to three left on this set. Uh, this is Kyle Seeger. Numbered out of 150. I need his brother, Corey Seeger, which is the rookie card for that year. That's going to be a tough find. I picked up a lot of cards from someone on Blowout, um, Blowout Forums. And the main reason why I bought this lot from the person was for this card, which is the Kettle Marte. I don't know if he's pronounced it Kettle or is it Kettle. I don't know. I'm going to call him Kettle. Kettle Marte. I just think it's cool. I watched him when the Arizona Diamondbacks were here for opening day weekend. Uh, I am impressed with him. I think he's a pretty good talent. I don't know if maybe health is an issue with him. I know he got injured earlier, I think this past week maybe. He didn't play, but I'm not really sure. I haven't looked up what's going on with him. But this is his rookie card from 2016. It's the black version, and I wanted to grab that for the collection. But... The person wanted to sell everything that they had all at once. And so I kind of cherry-picked all the really good players. I felt got an Abreu 2017, number to 99, green version. There's a Yelich Blue from 2017, number to 150. Abreu 2018 Sepia. DeGrom 2019 Sepia. There's a Molina 2019 Pink. DeGrom 2019 Blue Wave, number to 75. Vlad Pink, Rookie Cup from 2020 Topps Chrome. DeGrom Black, 2016 Topps Chrome. Pink of Albert Pujols, 2015 Topps Chrome. Molina, 2015 Sepia Topps Chrome. Buster Posey, Black from 2016 Topps Chrome. Adrian Beltre, Black, 2016 Topps Chrome. Here's a really cool Ichiro. I don't have too many Ichiro cards. I do have one in grading, actually, his rookie card from Topps Flagship. Um, so I'm excited to get that back someday in the near future. Hopefully near future. Uh, so here's his black from 2016 Topps Chrome. Pink, Buster Posey, 2016 Topps Chrome. And an, a cool X-Fractor of Albert Pujols from 2017. So I try to cherry-pick the players that are, you know, these are generally going to be Hall of Fame type players. Um, you know, Vlad is a little bit of a, of a reach right now. But Obreu is probably a little bit of a reach. Yelich, mm, not really sure about him. And Kettle Marte was the main reason why I wanted to get it.
get that lot. So that is that. Uh, and then the last thing I just wanted to catch up on is just all the trout stuff that I've been bringing in. Here is, what year is this? This is 2017 Tops Tribute Green, numbered to 99. Pretty cool shot of him. I'm going to try to get maybe some more Tops Tribute. The only thing I don't like about Tops Tribute is they're a little thicker. So you need to have these thicker top loaders to hold them. And, and sometimes they can be a little bit loose in here. So uh, I try to stay away from thicker cards for that reason. 2019 uh, update series gold of trout numbered to 2019. And a really cool card that I didn't, I've never seen before. When I saw it on eBay, I thought, well, looks cool. I'll pick it up. I'll try to pick it up. Made an offer and they accepted it. This is from the 20, ooh, 2018 Tops flagship set. This is the black version of the insert set, the 1983 version, and these are numbered at a 2.99. So it's in good shape, probably not a 10 condition, but um, good enough to have in the collection for sure. So that's it for now. Hope everybody's doing well. Wish me luck on my ride home today. Hopefully. People will be paying attention on the roadway. Uh, and uh, I will talk to you guys next week. See ya.